All right. Question number one. What animal led Eve to eat the forbidden fruit? A snake. Yeah, you should see how much they're worth. Sorry, you're right, I should. That one was worth $2. You want $2. This is for both of you. Listen up. God rested on what day? Seven. There you go. You want, sorry, that one was worth $2. I should just say in this question for this price. Okay. The seventh. Very good. Okay. This one's worth three dollars. I shouldn't make a race either. If you have one for bait, you should just give it to her. Let her try to answer it. It's not fair to have a race. They have like different dollars levels. Alright, the other one then I'll do for just page. Um sorry, who where were we? Okay, alright. This one's worth a dollar. Who built the ark? Noah. Noah. Did I make these too easy? Are you, are you just walking away with our money? <laughs> yes, that's what's happening. Uh, Paige, one dollar. What were the names of the first two people? Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve. Very good. Paige's dollar. Adam and Eve. Okay. Two dollar question. Here we go. What was God's punishment to Adam and Eve for eating the forbidden fruit? For Eve eating the forbidden fruit. Sorry. Was there punishment? What was the punishment? There was a consequence. Maybe not a punishment. There was a consequence to that action. You can talk it out. Like, what happened? Talk it out. Well, they, like, realized that they had no clothes on. That's true. Now, yeah. all of a sudden, they had a sense of self and... They knew they were naked, Our, which was embarrassment. Yeah, and that they're going to die because of their shit. Now they had a death, yep. And they're not going to live eternal life. Uh-huh. Um, You're right, those were all consequences. Yeah. What was keep the going. overall big one? Yep, keep going. Just keep talking it out. What else? Like the worst. What was the Where end does it take result? Place? Where does it take place? Garden. Uh-huh. Yeah. So what happened after he ate the fruit? Alright, I'm going to give you 30 more seconds and I'm going to hand it to your sister. <laughs> She's kind of right. She just didn't get it all. Right, I want the one monument consequence. Yeah. You're right, death is a pretty monument consequence. Yeah. I guess I didn't think of that. To but I'm thinking hard. of like the one overall big consequence. Right. Are you thinking? You, know? okay, you think you know it? You'll have a minute to answer. All right, 15 seconds. What else happened to him? All right, Paige, what do you think? They had to work as no. farmers. Like, in the garden. Um, they are I mean, that may have happened, but no. Overall, overall big thing that happened is they were like banished from the garden. Oh, yeah. They, yeah, that was so the big to consequence. So they had to go, yes. They, they went survive. from paradise they, to being banished like from the beautiful garden. Yes. So maybe that was one I should have thought through. Okay. You guys are doing, like, trivia. That was worth two. Yep. For Jay's birthday. Her, her, win a little money. Okay. I suck, apparently. Okay, this one's worth three bucks. What part of Adam's body did do, what, did God take to use to make his mate Eve? Rib. A rib. Very good. I made these That's ones easy. Better. Okay, three dollars. You know, I must have heard that somewhere Banking before. It, bro. Because I actually knew that one. Okay. Good job. Um, okay, this one's for a dollar. What did David defeat Goliath with? Stone and slingshot. A what? Stone and slingshot. A slingshot. Very good. Stone and a sling. Yeah. Well, it's, it's a slingshot. So it slingshot. And a stone. Very good. You got both parts of that. One dollar. She's like, look at the pile, girl. <laughs> look at 
Okay, this one's for $2. This is kind of a hard one. How many days was Jesus dead before he rose again? Three days. Very good. This one's Easter. over here. That was easy. Yeah, I'm glad you guys think it's these are easy. It's Friday and then Easter's on Sunday. Yeah, very good. Okay, um, for two dollars, what city was Jesus born in? Very good. Did he like move to Jerusalem? I don't know why I was thinking that. He wouldn't have stayed there because he was born in what? The state. Actually, that's another question. Yeah, okay, sorry. That one was for two bucks. Keep on keeping on. I was gonna be, I didn't, I couldn't remember which one going. he was born in and which one he was. Okay, we did the first two people. We did who built the ark. We did what animal? We got rested. Okay. Okay, here's one for three bucks. What seed did God part for his people to escape Egypt? Yeah, you're right. Which one is the Red Sea? The Red Sea. Oh, yes. That was one. That was one. Because a lot of people would say it's... Oh, wait. It's, I know it's, a, it's either the Red Sea or the Black Sea. Mm-hmm. Uh, people would say that it was like... Sea, though, right? Um, like it was like the blood of the, of the yeah. e Egyptian soldiers was made it red. It's actually red coral that makes it red, but all the same. It was the Red Sea. Good job. So that one was for... Oops, I can't find it. Three. Let's see the bad part. Yep, three bucks. Okay. How much have you made? Mm -hmm. you made <laughs> so you can't answer questions and do math at the same time? No. Okay, we're going to throw another one to Paigey. Got a chance to win two bucks, Paige. Who led, who led God's people out of Egypt? Ooh. Who did it? Sorry, who? David? Nope. Jay? Was it Paul? Nope. There's like so many leaders. Moses. Oh. There's so many people. They went on the mountain. Okay. Two bucks goes back in Dad's pocket. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. <laughs> okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, what was that? What was coffee. Dad's punishment? We did that. What part of Adam's body? We did that. Okay, we did that. Um... Jay, two dollars. Who are Jesus' parents? Mary and Joseph. Very good. Well, technically, right. Anyway. <laughs> okay. So, okay. 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 We did that. Jay, what was Jesus laid in after birth? The. Oh my gosh! I can't think of the name. For two dollars. You know, I came across the story recently. Miss Nut, or I'm sorry, Miss Rudisell posted it online, and it was the story of of the baby in the manger, and that he was wrapped in cloth. And they got that, they got the word to the shepherds. When the word got to the shepherds that there was a baby born in Bethlehem, and he was wrapped in cloth and put in a manger, the shepherds immediately knew what had happened that that the Savior was born because shepherds. They had, back then, they did a daily... Before Jesus was born. They did a uh, daily sacrifice to the Lord, a blood sacrifice, and they would take their best of their flock, mm -hmm. and they would wrap it, well, the lambs, they, they would wrap cloth, it in cloth so they weren't bruised or anything, yeah. and they'd Tree set it in a manger to be protected. And so the shepherds knew because it would be sacrificed. So they knew when they said a baby had been born and wrapped in cloth and put in a manger, they knew that the sacrificial lamb was here. Was here, yeah. Best story, I'm telling you what, probably best story I heard all year. I've not been able to get out of my that's head right. since. That's why the Lord Jesus is our sacrificial lamb. Yep. He was put here to die. 
for us. Yeah, that's right. It was. His and there were blood sacrifices before Jesus came. Yep. Once and Jesus, and there were still blood sacrifices until Jesus, until Jesus gave His blood for yeah. us. That's right. And then after Jesus died for our sins. I don't think that they did no, those daily no sacrifices blood. because the now we were cleansed in the yeah. blood of Christ. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we did them all but one, so I think I miscounted the, the money. Did we do the last one, Paige? Wait, it was the manger. Okay, nope, so that's the $2 for the question for the manger. Right. Now, big $5 question. Name 10 books of the Bible. I can do this. You know, I memorized the whole New Testament, but I probably can't read them. Okay. So, do, do that have to be in order? Nope. Just any time? Yep. Okay, so. Ten. I just Genesis, named them I know the first four Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, and Deuteronomy. And then. Just leave her be. Is there a graphic out on that? I think there are 39 of them or something like that, so. 61. Or 61. That would be New and Old Testament. Yeah. Yeah. Um. How many have you done? Keep track. Okay. One starts with an M. There's a lot. Just let it go. Just start saying them. You know more than you've said. I do know more. I'm trying to think. I'll give you a minute on this one. You got four of them right off the jump. Wow, and those are harder ones. And those there's are harder ones. You can just think I was going to so say, easy. when people think of names of the Bible, books yeah, of the Bible, they don't of think of Exodus, Leviticus, and uh, Deuteronomy. That's right. Those are not the those ones are people, not the ones people <laughs> pop remember. out of their head. There's a bunch of names <laughs> that are really easy. There's Esther. There, isn't that one? I don't think Queen there's Esther. Esther's, Esther's Esther. a lady in the Bible, but she is not, not a book. book in the not Bible. I will look I to be sure, but I don't think Esther is a book of the Bible. So. No. Don't forget Nikki's recording. Yeah, I know. Hi, Cameron. Um, it's too long now, and I never believe it matters. Yeah, I don't think Esther. There's a lot. There's a lot of them. There. And I know you know more of them than four. What's the first one? Okay, well, m my nephew's name is two of them. Yeah, I know Luke and oh. And what else? The first so start word talking. Word of the okay, so start Luke. Do you know his middle name? What's the rest no, of Luke's middle? Name. Yeah. <laughs> you want to help her with one? Matthew. Matthew. I don't know Luke's middle name. Luke Matthew. Um. So yeah. keep going on that yeah. line, Luke, Matthew. So four, six, is there Paul? Six? Is that one of them? I think there are two books three of Paul. There's another. There's another name. There's another name I can yeah, think of. Books. Oh, there's three of a book. There's some three people, of a book. Some people call one of the names a toilet. John. First John, second John, and third John. We're not doing that. Aww. Sorry. You're right, those are books, but nope. <laughs> There's plenty of them for you to Wait, name. Wait, Justin's time names. is almost up. Two more. Her time's almost up. What time? Oh, and then it's your turn to finish. Is that what's going on here? Um. What time? Anyway. Come on, Jay. She's trying to give me a time limit. She's trying to get her dollar. Yeah. Um, Thirty more seconds. There's two, there's two more. We'll give you one more on. minute. If you don't get them, we're giving it to your sister. And she'll earn one of your dollars. No, I get the five full dollars. Uh, no. There you go. <laughs> um. And the book of the Bible. What a thing. What a thing. Revolution. Or revelation. Revelation. Very good. So what are we at? Nine now? Yep. Nine books of the Bible so far. You know any more? Is Moses in there? No. Oh, well, I know that he's a main character in one That's of the books. That's a thing. That's true. Then That's what, true. What book is he in? What book is he a main character in? It's already been in there. Shut up. No, I haven't. Um, well, we restarted her a minute when she got the last answer. So you got a minute from then. Dad, you're going to pop out of the loop. Mike. Oh. Hey. Hey. Um, you're doing something. Esther is a book in the Bible. Darn. 
You're done. Yes, it is. I'm sorry. I, I didn't told even see you it. it was. I didn't even see Yep, it is. I'm like, wow, it's right there. I have an arrow pointed at it. Matthew Mark was John. <laughs> first to second Corinthians. Yeah. First to second Corinthians. Ephesians, Colossians. Uh, Thessalonians. See me and Paige memorized. Um, nice. Exodus Dad said you had. He's like, get her to do the whole first chapter. Number. And I'm like, that's a lot. You forgot Baby. about numbers. Baby, I'm, proud. All right, then. I'm, I'm proud of that. All right then. You rock that. Girl. You forgot about numbers, Justin. Rock that. Girl. Genesis, hey. Exodus, Leviticus, numbers. Here you go, Martha. Numbers. Teenager. <laughs> Alright. Good job. I'm proud of you guys. That was awesome. But yeah, me and Paige memorized the New Testament. Oh, these ones are mine. A couple of them were tough. I just gave Paige like, what, two bucks or something like that? Yeah. Yep. And then whatever she wanted. Let's do gifts now. Congratulations. How much did you make?